scared now. We can get stuck out here. <laughs> wow, that killed me. This is the easement road to lot 435. That's one of the lots we sold. People on it. There's people over there. So 1.25 acres right here. Show that map. You know what? Let's take a look at that map, make sure we're right now that I think about it. That doesn't look that far, does it? That's got to that, be 660. I'd say that's 660. Okay, I think the far end of the maps were the, because uh, there is a quarter mile road, we can cut across the desert if we need to and get it to the same place. That's your Verizon 4G tower, right? Uh, yes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Day before Father's Day, I believe, out here. I think it's the 14th. It's a Saturday and just beautiful. Again, Witchwell Ranches, ladies and gentlemen. We're at about 6,000 feet elevation, and uh, the highs forecast to be 84 today. It was about 76 when we checked the temperature a little bit ago. Perfect weather at this altitude. Uh, people from Phoenix, Houston, they love to get the foothills of the White Mountains here. And we have a 1.25 acre lot right in front of you, item number 97350, and that's actually lot 435, unit 4, here in the Witchwell area, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we've had lots out here in the past, been probably five, six years since we got a lot out here. People camp on them. Got people been staying up there for six months. That guy over there has been there for years now. So other people on that hill over there. But basically, you have your easement right in front of you. Not many people been using this one. The highway is a mile and a half about. And you have that uh, Verizon 4G tower I just showed you. So your internet, your phone works great out here. Uh, I believe it's less than a mile to uh, 7230, the main road. We'll be showing you all this on the maps to make a lot more sense. But the lot, 1.25 acres, 165 foot on your easement here, 330 feet back that way. And I do see you have a few prairie dogs that have got in here. So if you have horses or riding motorcycles, you wanna be careful, you can get rid of them. A lot of people like them. Anyhow, we're going to show you this uh, lot, and I'll, I guess I'll play a little drone footage over there. All right, ladies and gentlemen, lot 435 out here, and we've came 165 feet in, which is halfway into your lot. So if you wanted to build in the middle of your lot, your lot goes 165 feet that way, still another 165 that way. So it's actually 165 on the road. 330 feet back, 1.25 acres. And uh, there you have a good view of your next neighbor. They might be a quarter mile away. Another neighbor, a little over a quarter of a mile away. And another neighbor, a few hundred feet back there. I think his name's Corky. He's been there years, they say. And uh, your other neighbors are a few more prairie dog holes. So there's a neighbor, a quarter mile to the north. There's the other end of your lot, 
and then another neighbor an eighth of a mile away another neighbor a little over a quarter of a mile and they're there this morning and then there'll be a flag at the halfway point that's the other side of this lot here This is the high point at the back of your lot, and where the truck is, 330 feet, that's the road. So you have a plateau through here, probably a good half acre, high point, good place to build. And then it goes down, and you have a little flat there. So uh, if you want to get your feet wet, have a place to put your RV, a container, go out camping in those hot months if you're in Phoenix or Houston. Or have your bug out place 1.25 acres and solar is the way to go out here too we'll show you our place southwest corner of this 1.25 acre lot. You might be able to see the truck on that side of your screen. Ron's heading back down to the road, so we'll see where the other side is. And yeah, just gorgeous out here, perfect weather. Uh, also, you will get all of the GPS coordinates for this lot, maps, everything is inclusive. Uh, no liens, back taxes, anything like that. So. Uh, a chance to get a steal of a deal on a 1.25 acre little slice of paradise out here in the Old West, ladies and gentlemen. Lot 435, yeah. Alright, we're still up here at the southwest corner of the lot. Ron's back on the road at the southeast corner. In the front of the truck would be your other corner. So that gives you a good visual of 1.25 acres. Or put it another way for you, that's going to be getting close to 60,000 square feet. Or 50,000 square feet. I'll tell you in just a second. There's Ron. Wait to him, Ron. There's your high point. Nice level. Little gentle slope so no water is going to stay on your lot. So that's going to conclude our showing of lot 435. We'll show you some more B-roll around the area.